Good morning everyone. So it's currently 10 o'clock on Friday and it's also my brother's birthday. So of course we have to go and celebrate. This is our first holiday in this year and we're super excited. We're off to Centre Parks today. I'm gonna go pick up my sister now. My boyfriend Josh is gonna pick up the boys and then I'm taking Kessie and it's gonna be like a girl versus boys type of thing. Um, so yeah, I'm really, really excited. I've got all of my stuff in the car. As you can see, I'm ready already. So I'm gonna head off to my mum's, pick my sister up and have ourselves a really fun time. This is something that I just feel like we just need so much. Obviously I've been poorly, we've been working and this year has just been crazy. So hopefully this holiday works out well for us and we have a really good time. So really looking forward to it. So yeah, I'm gonna head off to my mum's now and I'll see you guys soon. So currently racing Josh to centre parks. This is Cassie Cam by the way. And this is Cora. Oh, we've got the fruit and veg in the back there. Just a little bit of little shopping room. So this is uh, Cassie Cam again. The boys are like four cars away. I think it's like five now. So they're never catching up to us. We are now eight miles away. Arrive at centre parks, Longleat Forest. So, <laughs> So fast forward a little bit, we have now arrived at Centre Parks. We've just picked up our bikes. As you can see, everyone's whipping themselves around in the background there. So basically we can't really get into our lodges until four o'clock. It's actually quarter past two now, I think. So we're just gonna have a little whiz around on our bikes and have a little look around what's going on, find our lodge. And then when four o'clock comes, we can actually get our car, unpack everything and I will show you guys the lodge and everything but yeah we're gonna have a little wander around now so I will see you guys in a little bit <laughs> So basically, we are trying to find our lodge. This park is so big, like crazy big. So we've got lost a couple of times. So basically, we have actually arrived into our lodge now, but we are running late. We do have Paul booked in literally 10, 15 minutes. We've got to try and get our cars back to the car park, get our bikes and head off to the sports plaza. I don't know how long that's gonna take, but I will show you a tour at some point over the weekend, but it isn't gonna be now because we literally have to go. We've got our keys and we've got to go out the door because we are very, very late, which is just brilliant. Basically the car park to get out of, to get into our lodge was absolutely rammed. So everything's just a little bit behind at the moment. So we've just arrived at the sports um, plaza, plaza, cafe area. Um, as you can see, there's a lot of sports and things going on around us. Um, luckily we didn't really have to check in or anything. Our pool table is literally just like reserved here. We've got a table and the two pool queues just set up ready for us. So we didn't really need to speak to anyone or anything. It's just set up ready for us to go. So that was really, really good. Um, so yeah, I'll show you guys around the area. So this is Jack playing pool. Missed a shot. Terrible. We've got Jordan and Josh and then Kessie's over here ordering some food. What are you getting, Kess? Getting food. food. Oh, we're getting drinks. Getting a tango. So yeah, I think over here we've got like a games arcade area and then at the back there's like a climbing wall, which is pretty weird, just in the middle of a pool table. But yeah, you can see it's quite quiet here, which we're quite surprised by. But I guess all the kids are back to school, so it's going to be like this. Um, and literally the sports cafe, which we've booked for tonight, is right here. So literally a stone's throw away. I'll quickly show you the view from this bridge area. So over here we've got this roller rink, but it looks like a tennis court to me, I don't know. And then over here we've got a mini adventure golf, I guess for kids, and you've got the climbing wall back there. The guys are down there. So I'm gonna head off now, play a game of pool, and catch up with you guys later. Focus on my eye, then. Yeah. Oh, yeah, 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 sorry, yeah. So, as you can tell, we're currently in the sports cafe. We've got our food. Um, Josh's gone for a burger, Jordan's gone for a half a chicken, I think. Club chicken. And then Kessie's got a vegan burger, and Jack's got some loaded fries, and then I've got a vegan burger as well. So. That is wild. <laughs> Good morning guys, so it's now the day after yesterday, which is Saturday. Um, we basically 
went to the sports cafe last night but it got pretty dark and it was raining all night so I didn't really vlog um, but it's the morning now so we're about to make breakfast I will show you the view though because it looks really really cool like waking up in the middle of a forest is just like sick so I'm gonna show you guys the view so this is the view from our front room like living area as you can see we're completely surrounded by massive trees which is pretty cool Jordan's just got out of the shower so excuse the hair dryer um, but yeah that is the view um, we're about to have breakfast Josh has got his he's just gone for honey nut clusters in a cup of tea so we've got a selection of fruits here we've got bananas orange apples grapes birthday cake so let's make some breakfast about to go off and do some swimming um, I've got this little cord set on from in the start I'm actually using Josh's phone because for some reason the audio on my phone is really cracky I don't really know why um, yeah I don't, I'm not really sure if this cord set suits me but we'll just go with it something comfortable to wear on our journey we've got our bikes we don't really have our map because our map's gone missing so we're just literally winging it hopefully we can remember from yesterday but it's so big here it's like really easy to get lost but look at those tree views. Oh my God, it looks so cool. I don't know if you can hear me with the mask on. We're currently in the supermarket. We're waiting to go swimming, but I booked it for half past 10 instead of 10. So we've got to kind of burn up some time before we go. This mask is really annoying. You can hear me breathing in and out. It's just really weird. Swimming. We're about to go swimming. Swimming in the sea. This is Cassie. <laughs> this is Cassie Cam. Hello. Hello. A little update we have now finished swimming we've kind of gone home had a little bit of like lunch we made a packed lunch earlier when we had our breakfast um, and we're now just going to go on a little bike ride and then go off to the pancake house i think it's by the sports plaza so about 10 minute cycle not even that i don't think so yeah we've got our bikes again quick outfit change put on a little bit of makeup and we're just going to have a good old little wonder i guess <laughs> The test room's kicked in. Oh uh, yeah, they've got easy way down, haven't they? Should have done that. You're more posh, No. You both come from Scum. Do we? Yeah. That's not nice. I'm from Lawrence West then. Yeah, where do I come from? South. Are you going tomorrow? Yeah, in the when south. You for? Oh yeah. He was hoping a fight would happen. On the tap. We've just arrived at the pancake house. Um, this is the menu here. So we've got Belgian Dessert waffles, pancakes, pancakes oh, American stacks. We've also got like savoury stuff like omelettes, but I'm definitely going to have a stack of pancakes. So I feel like I'm going to have um, either the ultimate chocolate. That does look good there. Cookie Monster. Mm. How's your pancake, Jack? Oh, it's great, honestly. Is it good, the pancake? That, that is great. <laughs> yeah, no, no. <laughs> How's yours, Kev? Good. Go on, then. Taste, Kev. It's alright, guys. <laughs> How's yours, Josh? Soft. Soft? Mm. Ooh. 
literally I swear every time I speak to you guys I look worse but we're just gonna ignore it we're having a good time um, we're currently at a beach kind of like man-made beach that centre parks have here and um, there are a few ducks and stuff like that but I'm not gonna get too close obviously because I have a big phobia of birds but yeah we're just gonna chill here for an hour or so as the sun sets um, we've got golf booked for half past six so we're gonna do that as well so I'm gonna get on my bike park it up and we're all just gonna chill here and take in the views really because they are pretty pretty cool so i've just parked my bike up and we're currently by the little lake and i'm just going to show you how close the fish actually are to us um, and i'm quite surprised how close i've actually got to the birds as well so we are conquering all types of fears today as you can see on camera they're literally like here and then we've got some ducks and a little bird asleep there as well. They're super cute, they're like making these weird noises. So weird. But yeah, can you see the fish there? Whoa. <gasps> Boy, that was a big fish. <gasps> Whoa, it's doing tricks. The ducks have rallied. <laughs> Jumping out. <gasps> Whoa! <laughs> Hello, Cassie. This is Cora speaking. No problem. No problem. <laughs> Repeat that again, please. There'll be a problem in a minute. <laughs> This conversation's over. 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 Sorry, mate, you just cut out. Over. So we've just finished our little stop off at the beach. We're now about to go and play some mini golf. Hole one. Kess is going first. Go on then, Kess. Got your uh, balls? Yeah, my pocket. <laughs> everyone so today is day three of our holiday which is super sad we've got one day left tomorrow but obviously we've got to be out of our lodge by nine o'clock in the morning which is going to be a really early start to be honest because we're gonna to have to cycle all the way to the car park come back with the car load the car take the car back pick up our bikes and then have an adventure in the morning because we're allowed to stay here till 12 but obviously it depends how we feel if we want to stay here that long or just head off home it depends literally on the morning so today is our last like full day which is just crazy how quick this holiday's gone by but it's been absolutely amazing so yeah i'll show you guys around the lodge today because i haven't done that yet um it is a mess i'm not gonna lie we have pretty much made it our own home so ignore that i will show you the view from behind our bedroom because this is really really cool so this is our view to wake up with in the morning it's really really nice Oh, I'm gonna miss this view so much. It's just really really cool like waking up literally in the middle of the forest. We've got our little um, Outdoor area here, which I'll show you guys in a minute, but this is our bed <laughs> um, It's a bit messy because obviously we've just woken up and slept in but we've got two single beds here But we just put them together as a double because there's only one double bed and then in this one is Jordan's room so he's got a double bed and he's also got the TV because obviously it's his birthday so we decided to give him the best room and the view from his bedroom is actually cooler than mine to be honest because he's literally just got forest only and then this is Kessie and Jack's room it looks like someone's actually slept on the floor which is pretty weird what I didn't realise is Kessie's got this really cute little dressing room area Damn, I wish I chose this room instead now because that would be really good to get myself ready with. So then as you come out of Cassie and Jack's room, we've got our lounge area. So we've got these little blinds here and our bikes are literally just parked just outside. 
and this is our little kitchen. So this is our little lounge seating area. Got a really nice picture of trees to kind of replicate the view outside, I guess. Um, so yeah, this is the little lounge area. Open up the curtains. So yeah, as we step outside, we've got this little dining area bit. Got a fire barbecue area. You can hear all the birds. It sounds really, really peaceful. Oh my God, it's really therapeutic. I might eat my breakfast out here today because that's something we haven't done yet. What are you doing then? We're about to go tree climbing, boy. Yeah, boy. It's a comedy show. Come on. The tiniest little. St there it is. Come on, just get your other foot on. There it is. Okay, so we have actually finished the tree climbing. That was just honestly really, really scary. I managed to do it, which is I'm really proud of because I just thought, you know what? Every little stage was as worse as that stage got. So that kind of got me through it. Um, and then to be honest, actually zip wiring off the top up there wasn't as bad as I thought either. So we're now moving on to the next activity, which is kayaking. Man's just got back from rowing. It was pretty good, wasn't it, Corey? Yeah, it was but good. Look, look at this. 